Good boy. You can chew on it. Here, come here. Concluding his 36th week of life. So here we are. Uh, we just got back from a training session. <laughs> Make a funny noise, buddy. You all right? You okay? Can you breathe? <laughs> okay, you got awfully quiet. So um, I'm gonna have to rush through this one because I've got a bunch of stuff to do and it's getting too late to do it. So yeah. Um, for his weight, he is still sitting at 65 pounds, so no change there. And for his height, again, he is still sitting at 23 inches at the shoulder, no change there. But that's pretty normal, at about this age, they start slowing down quite a bit. Um, training went well today, we worked on heel, which is to get him to really tighten up that walking with me. And he did pretty good, We uh, he got to interact with the dog trainer's dog. And he was not afraid, he was having a pretty good time actually, and the dog was very friendly, so it helped a lot. That's probably the calmest I've ever seen him around a strange dog, so that was pretty cool. And we also walked outside for a bit, so it was a place he's never seen before, and there was a bunch of buses going by, and strange people, and at first he was kind of just like, uh, <laughs> but once he got used to it, I mean, he, he did really well. He just kind of lay down on the sidewalk while we were talking, and just chilled there, so. His training is going really well. I want you in the shot, buddy. So yeah, the training session went really well. The trainer is really impressed with how far he's gotten, and I am too. Like This is really neat to watch. So that's about all we did for this session. I think the next session we're going to be practicing um, long leash and down and stuff like that. So that should be really neat. Um, what else? I think we're just got extra information at this point. So for that... Um, so he's doing pretty well with the training that I'm doing at home. I've been practicing the walking and the place and this and that. You can see place on the trick video that I did last weekend. So you can go check that out if you haven't. It's his updated little repertoire of tricks. Um, and just around the house, he's been doing really well. Like we can leave him off leash a lot. And he doesn't normally get himself into trouble. So but yeah. So this dude is tired, if you can't tell. He is like exhausted, extremely, extremely exhausted, but that's good. That's, I'm glad the training session can kind of chill him out like that. But like I was saying, other than that, there's not much to update on this week. It was just basically practicing all this at home and he's just doing great. He's slowly getting there more and more and we're making really good progress. So. That's, that's a good sign. He's starting to relax. You can see him right now. He's just kind of like, <sighs> yeah. Well, I mean, he's breathing harder than that, but he's very just kind of like, okay, so I don't need to worry about everything. So, yeah, but you feel better? You feel better? Yeah? Yeah? You feel like a good boy? Yeah. So uh, this video is probably extremely, extremely short, but like I said, there's places I need to be right now. So I just wanted to get this update filmed, and unfortunately it's probably not going to get uploaded to really late tonight, so I definitely apologize for that in advance, even though you won't see this until it's uploaded. Anyway though, um, I think that is all I'd update you guys on. He's just progressing with his training and becoming more and more of the well-behaved dog that I was hoping he'd be. Yeah, he's a happy boy. So, um, I guess I'll throw in a little tidbit with the car. I don't know, uh, the last update you guys had about him going for car rides. I kind of slowed them down a little bit because I don't have time to take him every day. But now when he's in the car, he just, he just sits very politely in the seat behind me and he just looks out the window. So, all that... I think I'd mentioned way, way back when I first got him, I was taking him for car rides every single day to get him used to it. And it seemed like I wasn't getting anywhere because he was still kind of like excited while he was in the car. But I can tell you by now, and he's been doing this for like a month or two, it has paid off. He is now just chilled out in the car. He's either laying down or sleeping, or he's sticking his nose out the window, or he's just sitting down and looking out the window. So it pays off eventually, it just takes a little time. But yeah, so I think we're ready to wrap it up. Yeah, buddy.
Wanna say bye? Bye everybody! Did you say bye? High five! <laughs> that was the laziest high five ever. You're so cute. You're so cute. Yeah. Ready to take a nap? Yeah. Alright, thanks for watching guys. See you next weekend.